do that this morning. Hey, we are here talking with Nadej uh, Norian. Yes. You got it right. And, and Nadej is um, a patisserie uh, that focuses on, on many things, but the macaron. Tell me a little bit about the macaron that we have here. So here today we're going to present the pumpkin macaron because it's the season. We do a lot of flavor back in our shop. And depending on the season, we do sometimes things, you know, different things. So and the macaron itself is almost like a sandwich. It is a sandwich. So you got a uh, chef. So mm -hmm. we're going to talk about quickly how to make the chef. And then you got a filling. And uh, so today, pumpkin filling. And then another shelf. And then you got a perfect sandwich. Okay, so Sweet let's talk sandwich. about making that first. So first, uh, we got a filling. Uh, so the filling is made with an Italian meringue. Mm -hmm. So it's eggs and syrup uh, mixed together. Egg white, sorry. And then we got ground almond icing sugar. Uh, a little bit of orange color, a little bit of spice for that uh, particular flavor. And then we mix it together, something pretty smooth like mm -hmm. that. Do you so think somebody that's new to baking or new to, to do? It will need a bit of time. A little like, bit of time. A little yeah. bit of training. Yeah, a little bit. It is a bit technical, but you got a lot of, uh, you know, uh, tips on the internet. I give that recipe uh, on the internet. So, you know, maybe about two or three times practice, you can get there. Okay. Yeah. And then you got it in the piping bag. And then bag. we got into the piping bag, so that's, you know, the filling. It has to be pretty soft. And here we just have, uh, you know, not too, too big of a tips. And then we just pipe um, round shape like that onto... Look at how um, fast you do that. <laughs> hey, you've done this a few. <laughs> Few, just a few. <laughs> just a few times. Yeah. How long would we bake those off for? So this is going to be in the oven um, around 12 minutes at um, 285 Fahrenheit. Right. So we bang a little bit the tray to flat like that. Oh, and they flatten them out. I and can see that. And they flat them out. Perfect. You will need to dry them for 20 minutes right. before put them in the oven. Okay. And okay. then I guess the next step, of course, is the filling. Yeah. So we're going to have, sorry, here. No worries. We got the cream. We got some uh, rusted uh, pumpkin, a little bit of spice. So we have uh, uh, hot cream warm chocolate and we're just going to put the three together mm -hmm. so we're going to start mixing the cream into the chocolate okay and we just mix until it's smooth nice and smooth we have one minute but i want to make sure while you're mixing that right there and that's beeping off uh you have some beautiful beautiful uh boxes over here by yeah. local canadian artists so we decide to do a series sorry we decide to do a series by uh local Canadian artists, so we got six boxes and every month we're releasing one. Already two has been released, which is Virginia Johnson and uh, Steve Crook, so that was a fashion, uh, fashion designer and uh, photographer. So it was important to do that for us and say thank you to all the artists and, in and Toronto. And you have two locations? We have two locations, one in on Rosedale, Young Street, and one on Queen Street West, and we're opening a third one in the past in November. Okay, and we just, I guess after that, we're just going to pipe them in. I'm going to throw it a break right now yeah. while you're piping those in. For more information, what you're going to do is go to Nadej Patisserie, well, there's my French, dot com, <laughs> and you can go to at Nadej Toronto as well on Twitter. We'll have all that information on Breakfast Television right after the break. We're going to check out with, with Kevin, of course, and Kevin's going to tell us about the TTC and an update on some of those delays this morning.